Will, new season, new paintwork, always an exciting time. <laughs> it is always an exciting time, seeing all the new car liveries, new driver lineups, uh, but particularly for me, second year round at FPR and trading post racing, um, massive continuity and uh, a lot of people just throw that word out there lightly, but it's a pretty difficult thing to get, consistency, momentum, uh, starting a year with the same group of people, the same car, same engineer. I haven't had a lot of that in my career, so uh, as I said, I start this year absolutely full of confidence. I think everything looks fantastic. Everyone in our group is extremely excited. Now we've just got to capitalise and uh, be on the ball from the day, you know, the day dot. So give us a bit of an insight as to which areas of, say, a race weekend become easier once you've been with the team for a whole year. Um, I suppose it's just knowing knowing everyone, know the way all the structures work, the systems work, the way the meetings work, nothing's new for you. So you can just have productive work from straight away. You're not trying to learn new names, learn new faces, you know, how do they tune the car, what way do they do their engineering meetings. Uh, it's all, we're just down to business, we're not learning anything, we're just uh, continuing the hard work we did last year and I think throughout last year we, we certainly gained momentum and, and we improved the way we do all areas of our, our racing so uh, you know we can continually get better, we, uh, we can't relax for sure, we, we, we realise we've still got to do a better job than last year but um, that only comes down to hard work and focus and determination and we've got a great group of people that uh, are massively motivated and it's exciting exciting to be a part of a team where uh, everyone's so motivated and, and confident in, in what we need to do. There's no soul searching and, and unanswered questions. You know, we know what we've got, we've just got to get on with it. It's going to be a lot more mixed tyre races this year. How does that sit with you guys? Um, well, you know, certainly um, we, we struggled with the soft tyre in the middle part of the year, but uh, the hard work that the team did to improve our soft tyre performance at the end of last year was was just so great to be a part of. I was so proud of the team, and um, you know, I still think we've got a couple of little weaknesses in certain areas, but uh, you know, I think the results we showed on the soft tyre at the end of the year were extremely promising. So we're not too worried what they throw at us. Uh, mixed tyre races, you know, we know we've got a good car and pretty much all circumstances now, all conditions, all tyre conditions um, and we just need to be consistent, you know, you can't win every race, although you want to, you've just got to make sure that your bad days are still pretty good days. You've just come back from a training camp with the other FPR drivers in Noosa, how did you find that? Uh, it was it was great to be honest, uh, you know, we, we pushed ourselves mentally and physically beyond what you think you should be doing so uh, you know there was plenty of whinging and moaning and crying but uh, you know you leave those camps feeling a million bucks and uh, you know feeling mentally ready for anything whatever it throws at you so um, you know it's great that the team put on that sort of a camp it's good to bond with your teammates and uh, as I said you know bring on Clipsal now because uh, we've been through some pain in the last few days and um, you know that's what you need to do because it hurts at Clipsal but uh, you've got to be able to push through those pain barriers.